Life moves fast. KansasCity.com puts you in the driver's seat. Shop automotive for an inside look at the latest models and to find a great local deal. Place an ad, read what the experts say, and get advice on car care. In print, online, anytime. It's all right at your fingertips. Log on to KansasCity.com today and get the information you need at the speed of life. Um, and I was just thinking too, when you walk up, it just kind of hit me that it would be kind of nice if the back row goes back and you go to this room. I don't know if you're going to break your arm. And like you guys go to that room, you just walk up. This is Robert Trussell, theater critic with the Kansas City Star. Uh, the first time I saw Emily Lauren perform was at the 2005 KC Fringe Festival. Uh, she did a performance called Sugar Puppy and the Lovely Dumplings. And of all the theater uh, offerings I saw during that Fringe Festival, hers was the most memorable. Uh, she draws on uh, various traditions, including Commedia del Art and... Uh, her performances are very hard to describe. She calls it neo-burlesque, and it owes a little bit to uh, traditional striptease, but she really doesn't uh, do anything quite like that. The, these routines aren't very revealing. They can be suggestive, but they're usually very funny because she's making comments on uh, the traditional roles of women and how they're perceived and so on. Uh, so now she's uh, put together... Uh, a recital of her students and uh, most of these folks as I understand it have not performed publicly but they've been uh, studying the art of neo burlesque under her tutelage so uh, I'm looking forward to seeing what the results are uh, uh, because I'm sure they'll be quite interesting